Hi everyone, are you wanting the best Cricut Design Space tip for 2020? Then you're in the right place, stand by because I'm going to share it with you and it is going to blow your mind. If you don't know who I am, my name's Paul from Scissors Paper Paul on Instagram, Facebook and now YouTube and I'm here sharing all my Cricut expertise and knowledge with you so that you can master these incredible machines and products and ultimately I want you to make beautiful things. So let's get started but before we do let me know in the comments what is the best tip that you have for Cricut Design Space. Share that with me, share it with the rest of the people that might be watching the video and like always if you like this video give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my future content. Also I'd love it if you want to share this tip in all of the different groups uh, and just spread the word. So let's get into it. I'm just going to uh, move into Design Space and here is a project that I am working on um, with some Christmas uh, tags, which I will be sharing in my uh, Facebook page uh, very, very soon. Um, but how many times have you created a design and then you thought, oh God, I wish I could combine that other project that I've already done with this project. You know, you've already worked on another project, maybe you've contoured, you've changed colors, you've sized it, you've got everything perfect. I don't want to start again by adding all of those elements and recreating that design. I literally want to copy and paste it into my new canvas. Now you can with the latest update. So you have to have 6.0.150 or greater. Um, and now you can do just exactly that. And let's have a look. I'm going to go back to my projects and I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to open up this one, which is a Santa sack project. And now I'm going to use this and I want to um, make this into part of my incorporate into my tags. So I selected the image and then control C or command C or you can right click and copy. Then you go back into your projects, opening up my tag project, click in there and then control C, command C or right click and also paste. So control V or command V and there you go. It's pasted right into the project. I can now resize that and uh, that becomes part of my new design and I can save it or save as or whatever I need to do, um, but much, much simpler. So again, give me a thumbs up if you think that would be helpful in the comments, say yes or no if you think that you might use this update. Uh, again, in the comments, let me know if you've got any questions. I'll be happy to answer them. Have a wonderful day and uh, I'll see you next time. Take care.